Hi, I'm Gabriele Calabrese, and I would like to introduce you to another area of my wonderful land that is uh, Lucca province. I'm in Garfagnana. The mountains behind me are the Alpine Alps, and as you can see, are a wonderful crown of mountains uh, uh, that is the background of uh, the Lucchese area. And today I'm going to show you how in this wonderful green area we produce the best pecorino cheese uh, of the northwest uh, of Tuscany. See you later. This is the little vehicle uh, that Mr. Morovelli is preparing uh, to deliver all the products uh, that are in the productions of the family. As you can see here inside, is very well divided into sharing two with the prosciutto, salami and cheese uh, but above you can see even uh, little cakes and sweet products uh, so we're gonna see what they produce inside this uh, farm You can see behind the guys that is working with the um, yogurt and they put down at the base of the little vase uh, the uh, mirtilli eh? so it means or strawberries uh, or um, little fruits uh, it's a very nice product Jeez. here how the pecorino is produced is inside this uh, little uh, cylinders and has to be major of course uh, now is just done here is that there is another kind of cheese that is called primo sale it's a kind of cheese that uh, remain pretty fresh it is right now the moment uh, to eat it with fresh basil so you can see the lady that is preparing all the little uh, containers and here as well uh, you can see it's that another kind of production that probably is ricotta this is Mr. Morovelli uh, the leader and uh, all this cheese is going to be put inside this uh, kind of cisterns um, to be completely preserved from all the contamination and here is the milk, all the several productions of milk, uh, very fresh from this area. You see it's boiling uh, uh, and Mr. Morovelli is just uh, mixing uh, uh, the milk uh, to make the cheese. This is ricotta cheese, he said. Very fresh. Then I will taste it for sure. Now I'm going to enter inside a sort of a safe where the pecorino cheese is at the top of its uh, maturation. Look, it's incredible view of the pecorino cheese that is going to spend its time to be the best, to have the best flavor, to have the best taste, and to be by by the good tasters. Huh? Okay. Thank you.